Ready? Ready? I wonder how this dirt got on the decking. Anything to do with you? Hmm. Possibly. Look at those innocent eyes. Definitely wasn't her. No. I wonder how these plants fell out of their pots. Again, it wasn't you, was it? No, definitely wasn't you. No, they just fell there accidentally on their own. They grew legs and walked. She hasn't noticed the pigeon that's right Easy there. Right there. In the lawn. Maybe she'll notice it in a minute. Mm. No. So Alpha's grown quite a lot in the last couple of weeks. And so we are really focusing quite a lot on using a clicker. Very, very simply, <coughs> makes a click sound. And like with that, with like magic, look, she appears. So the good thing about clicker training is, and one, these are quite cheap. You can buy them on Amazon, like a pack of four for about 10 pounds, eight pounds. So really cheap to purchase. But the good thing about these is they're instantaneous sound they make so often a dog needs to know when they're doing something right and so with the clicker what you do is you immediately click as they get the behavior right now what can happen when you're dog training is particularly when they're puppies and they don't always listen is that your tone and your um frequency and the way and, and your swiftness in replying so your your actual reflex of replying to all the action can be delayed and so then you can actually sometimes end up praising behaviors you didn't actually want so you might praise them for the sit but actually as you're praising them they stand up or something like that so you very early on uh, use a clicker and what happens is when they hear the click they expect to treat so again if I click Uffa come so she's off in the garden somewhere she comes back and she gets a click and a treat um, right from the beginning, what you do is you just click and treat, click and treat, and you load the clicker. Now, she's already loaded the clicker, as you can see. Like, even the sound of the clicker makes her come, so that's good. So, Masco is now going to do a little bit of clicker with her and show, us, show you from the beginning what kind of things we've taught her. She still gets mixed up between them, so hopefully she'll give you a lovely demo of all the things she's learnt. But she does get a little bit confused sometimes, because she is a puppy. So if she gets confused, or if you have a puppy that gets confused with the clicker, um, just go back to when they were getting it right and, and then do that. Now the idea with clicker is you build up towards a, an overall behaviour you want. So sit and flat are quite easy, but then now she can do heel work with sits in the right position and things like that. And she's expected to do those without necessarily a click until she's completed the entire behaviour. But if you ever get an issue, just restart from the beginning of the, and, and go back from training. So what Masco is doing is he's reinforcing the command after the click. Ah. All right. Hey, let's move around. Upper, sit. Ah. Sit. <laughs> now you see, dogs can get confused. That's more of a flat. So yeah. You don't praise them. No. If you'd managed to like, ah. if you managed to catch the behaviour when she's in the right place, so now she's sitting. Then that would be when to do it. But it doesn't matter if you miss it, it's not an issue at all. Sit. So that's reinforcing. She did a good behaviour. That's it. Well, the issue we've got at the moment is she barks throughout her clicker. So she, so she thinks that barking is. Right. Oh, left. Now you see, sometimes dogs offer behaviour. So if they do it, praise them and tell them the command. Yeah. I think she might need a wee. Good. Good girl, come. So you, you start off by guiding them through a behaviour and then hopefully over time you can move to not even having to put your hand near. Put the bit of treat in your hand, in the nose, because left, 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 good. You just take it very slowly. I mean, we're not experts. We're really lucky that her breeder is a clicker trainer. So we have sessions with her every week. So we, we, we're the blind leading the blind a little bit, but she's taken to it really well.
Has he got you bored now? I have yeah. just the thing. Watch what happens. You put the box down and... <laughs> step up. This is the step up. And... Turn. 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 Go. Turn. So, that works. You just press through. Oh, you want to pull that. Alright. Step up. Good. Now that's again dogs offering behaviour, which is good. Alright. Turn. 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 <laughs> it's Turn. a favourite thing to do. We have no idea why, but she loves it. Turn. So whenever the box comes out, she just wants to... Oh, good girl, she's turned good as well. Turn. Good girl, turn. Now that's really good. She loves doing this for some reason. Spinning round in circles. Yes. She's and doing it on her own. Turn. Good girl. Turn. 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 Because the hardest bit of this trick is her turning her back on you because... Yeah. She, good girl! Oh, she came off. So that's where Marsco did it slightly wrong because she actually stopped the behaviour when he gave it the treat. That's but, how not to do it. Yeah, but... It, turn. Good. So she's getting it. I mean, this is even since last time we did it, her doing it so much on her own. But the retention span goes, so like she's like, oh, and it is very warm already. It's and really is, early. And this the sun's is really her hot. time of day when she goes for a nap. Nap. Right, I think some heel work. Yes. So heel work. So that is the position one. That is lovely. Good girl. So with heel work, if you do obedience, you'll know this, but the idea is the dog walks on your left hand side and walks by your leg. And the idea being that when she's on the lead, she'll just not pull. So she, we want her walking yeah. by your side. That's how and it that's, starts. Yeah. Well, actually to start with, you put the treat right in front of their nose. But it's small steps. Yeah. Right. Okay. So the really important thing with training is to keep them focused and keep commands coming because otherwise they just wander off. See, that's a really wonky step. So really... Parallel. No, it's not at all. It's not. <laughs> yes. So Masako has this thing where he changes his position to make sure he's in the right position. I mean, I did do I a little know. bit of proper um, obedience with my previous dog, so, um, and hopefully with her we'll get some proper certificates. But the important thing is to get her parallel with you. But, you know, the fact that she's only 12 weeks and being able to do all of this is incredible. Okay. So, <laughs> it's a hot morning when you want a pond break. That's a nice cam. That was good. Perfect. You ideally want them right in front of you. Yeah. That no, was good. Right. Heel. Right. Heel. Heel. And wonky step. Nope. <laughs> Your hands too low. Heel. Better. Go. So we're probably going to just wrap it up with a couple more things that she can do. She does paw. Obviously, that's very easy, isn't it? Yeah. And she does. We use flat because we use down for other things. So she does flat. 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 Good girl. There we go. So that's kind of what we've been doing with Clicker. Hopefully, in a few months' time, she'll be a complete pro. Won't you? You'll be a complete pro. But she's working hard on it and it keeps her stimulating. You can see she's this is a good kind of tired for a puppy. This isn't from running around. She's genuinely used this noggin of hers. And now she will sleep for probably about an hour because it's quite hard work having to think and work out what you have to do. And that's quite important as you're doing clicker to introduce new things because to keep them thinking because after a while they get a bit bored because they've done it all before. But now worked hard this morning. It's a bit warm. We'll all have a nap. Hey, Arthur, you sit down. Sit down. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye.